Welcome to Dan ARG YouTube. Emmanuel Aibogun say police don't shoot person for Igwomo community for Benin City for Edo State this afternoon. Make I leave you, make you hear from Emmanuel Aibogun. Yes, 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 yes. Good evening. A warm good evening to you all my conscious Edo people. I remain no other person than yours. Noble right activist, comrade I, Bogu Emmanuel. Yeah, if you are watching me this very minute, I want you to please share this broadcast. Uh, you're sharing this broadcast is going to save a life. Uh, you're sharing this broadcast is going to stop an impending justice uh, that has, you know, been bastardized by the Nigerian police force, owing to the fact that. Uh, some individuals within the police want to use their offices to continuously make money having known that the good people of Igomo community have gotten a judgment from the Supreme Court over a lingering land crisis in one the local government of Edo State. But because some few police officers are because our police are very very negligent in looking into the activities of their own most times although we see police doing it to ensure that they call certain persons to order but as at this point in time i think the good people of igomo community have continuously done what is expected of them as law-abiding citizens i will continue to say one festus idea i think as at, as at the time when he started this is a, a, a quest to pervert justice with his police office uh, he was uh, an inspector of police under working under the IRT, a very 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 influential inspector of police but from information available to me he has been promoted to the rank of superintendent even if he specializes in arresting community leaders in a do state in the name of crime in the name of crime all he does is to ensure that they collect money I, I stand to be corrected, I stand to be investigated with what I'm saying. I'm not just saying it because I want to talk. I'm saying it because people are also available that will queue behind me to testify on what I'm saying this very hour and this very minute. I'm calling, using this medium to call on the general public to draw the attention of the Inspector General of Police. Because as far as I'm concerned, the Deputy Inspector General of Police for CID is already aware of this issue. He has equally given a directive that the matter be be duly investigated but because of only god knows uh, uh the police investigation is very very slow but i, I think the deputy inspector general of police has given an order that this matter be investigated same on these issues we have also approached the commissioner of police to you know intimate him of what the issues are but to my very glad this afternoon a young man by the name clement gubadia this very afternoon was shot in his house by some police officers from the state CID. It is very sad that I am not in Benin City. If not, I would have been reporting live at the gate of the state CID this very hour. It is very, very sad I'm not in Benin City. If not, I will be in the gate of state CID doing this live broadcast because we, are, we cannot be living in Nigeria as if Nigeria is a lawless society, as if Nigeria you know, is uh, uh, the, the, the police institution is uh, is is the highest bidder's uh, 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 institution, whereby people with with the highest bidder's who want to pay money to achieve what they want will always get what they want. We know, and I am also informed that there are reforms that have been trying to be going on, but people who are contravening the law, people who are doing things because they want to to land because they want to they want to allege somebody of land of crisis where no seems to exist even where a court has given just last week here if you're on my wall the court of appeal also set aside the gazette of the Russian house of assembly making it known to the world that you don't have the power to obtain a supreme court judgment and we all know these things because very learned people know that once a supreme court judgment has been delivered in this country it is an issue you can only appeal to god everybody knows that so for me i do not understand why policemen would would, would 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 give room for such a thing now this afternoon they have gone to the young man's house shot him right at his house 
They went there in Siena on number Siena. Uh, from information available to me, and on number Siena, they shot this young man and took him away in a commando like manner. In a commando like manner. So I do not really understand what the Nigerian police want about the Igwoma and the Kumbu crisis. If you take a closer look of the complainants in this matter, that they will be coming to arrest this young man if there is any, it will be associated with the crisis in Igwoma and the Kumbu. And for crying out loud, the police will not call the Kumbu people. Vacate where courts have told you to vacate that does not belong to you. Are we not in this country? Are we, don't we? Don't the police see the judgment of the courts as, as 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 their duty to enforce? As a duty to ensure that all parties who are who are who are, who are related to a, you know a, a disputed matter that has been resolved by the court must must go by the judgment of the court. It is very very sad that as we speak, I am not in Benin, but I have made calls. I have also tried to reach the commissioner of police. Uh, I think trying to reach him severally, he has put my line on busy, and I will also come to the media to cry to draw the attention of the world because what they are doing to these people is the highest level of injustice and i want to use this medium to also beg the assistant the uh, uh, deputy inspector general of police for cid the inspector general of police to as a matter uh, as a matter of urgent public importance call all these alien parties all these parties to order i have written petitions on this effect which i will which i'll be putting on the media very soon for the world to see it is not like uh, some of us enjoy coming out to shout all the time even when we have done the needful, it is expected that we see reactions. That is why we, we, we want a Nigerian police to come to This is not a matter of President Mohamed Buhari. This is a matter of an institution. This matter has been long on and settled by the judgment for years. But I don't know why the police we want to hide under the force of a, a, a robbery, the force of a kidnapping, the force of a, 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 a arson to terrorize people who have ordinarily gotten something from the court. I think there is more to this. The Inspector General of Police, as I speak, should please come into this matter with all form of fairness because the Kumbo people will stop at nothing to use money to rob uh, the mass of anybody that they feel, you know, can help them to achieve their, their selfish desires. Arresting this young man doesn't mean that you have the capacity to arrest every other person. But the question I'm asking, how long shall we continue to support injustice? How long shall we continue to support this Just a few weeks ago, I was in the Court of Appeal, where judgment was delivered. I was also live, where, the, where their lawyers were, were, were letting the world know that this is the position of the court as of today. And as I speak to you, that judgment is handy, it is out. I'm out of a dosage, I'm only getting report now that policemen went to the vice chairman's house, shot him at his, at his house and took him away. I'm also just getting report now that these same policemen are about to interview the commissioner of police. This policeman who came to shoot somebody at, at their house. So, at the so we, are, we are using this medium to please. We are 32 persons watching this video at this moment. Uh, and I believe uh, if, if I spend a longer time, we, we should grow on this platform. But I, I have so much to do via offline. But I'm coming online to draw attention of the member of the public. I'm also using this attention to draw the attention of the deputy governor of Edo State who we all met some few weeks ago here over this same disputed land matter and the deputy governor said everybody should stay clear and I myself have also advised that all parties of Igbo must stay clear and they have also adhered to it. So what is now making the police to come and shoot a young man in his house because of land matter? Because, of, because of they have collected money? Because the police cannot tell me that such a young man who does not disturb anybody is not the problem that they will be shooting him in his house. So I do not understand the, the, the impression they want to create because I know the, for what I, from the information available to me, they want to create an impression that he's terrorizing the, the community, he's a terrorist, he's this, is that. I'm making it known because I'm well grounded and well informed about the activity. It is a community I live in. It's a community I know about what is going on. So I would, I would, I would want, I would want, I would want this federal general police as a matter of urgency to please ensure that there's fairness. There is, there is respect of law, you know, as regards to the arrest of this young man because we don't see a reason why, why such a thing should be happening at a time like this, even when the police is saying 
that they should be professional in their activities. So for me, I want to draw the window closed because uh, we'll continue making calls and making calls. I know very many viewers uh, 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 out there are, 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 are not helping and very many are helping. But I want you at this moment, the 38 of you who are watching me, please place your hands on the share button before we end this broadcast. I'm also doing a lot of shares because I want the entire state to be aware of what is going on. I want the entire state to be aware of what is going on. It's not so good that the police will not make themselves, you know, agents of, uh, of, of, of oppression in a, in a matter ordinarily that should not be. Uh, it's, it's so sad. It's so pathetic. Clement Gubadia has done nothing to the fact that police will go to his house to arrest him. Arresting him is not a crime, but shooting him in his house shows that the police are biased, shows that the police... Uh, 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 ordinarily, ordinarily, uh, you know, is, is working to the dictate of, 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 of someone who has paid them. Working to the dictate of someone who has paid them because I am aware of what is happening. It's not why somebody is telling me I'm aware. I've been following up this matter for years as a comrade and as an activist in the state. I've been observing, you know, holding, watching brief, seeing what is going on. I've made sure as, as a comrade I've made myself available only to the fact that I know On this matter so please please and, please and please and please and please and please i am begging let us at this moment let us at this moment assist these brokers with sharing with sharing this video please i want to beg each and every one of you who is here present please assist these brokers by sharing this video now i'm also doing the sharing here So please assist me and assist the brokers and assist the young man who has just been shot unjustly by sharing these brokers, please. I am, I am calling on well-meaning members. We are over 30 watching these brokers now. Please assist with sharing. Assist to share, and I'm also sharing as we speak. So please let us share, let us share the brokers. It's, it's, it's very fair and unjust that uh, things like this should be happening in our dear state. I'm trying to reach the Commissioner of Police, it's not taking my calls. Uh, I know his, his office is a very busy one, but even at that, I sent text messages, and I expect that they do what is expected. This this whole thing is uh, so sad. It's so 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 sad, so so sad, and uh, I'm not finding any funny at all. So if you're with us and you're out there, I want you to share this broadcast because I know it will definitely get to the Inspector General of Police. So please, we the people of Igbomo are peace-loving people. People of Igbomo are peace-loving people. I can attest to that any day, any time, anywhere. They are peace-loving people. Going to Clement Gubada's house to shoot him this afternoon and scat him away. To tell you how bad it is, uh, 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 the moment they are arresting him now, they shot him they are, because they know that they have done something bad. They want to get the cover of the commissioner of police. That is why they are running to him briefly to inform him that they have shot somebody. That is why they are that is why they are running to tell him that they are shot somebody because they know that yes some of us are, are, are always on the watch always on the watch so i'm begging uh we, we we are currently doing well now with the shares so i'm begging if you're if you're if you're a concerned a dope person uh please ensure you ensure you ensure you share the broadcast please Please and please ensure you share the broadcast uh, on our end. On our end, we sincerely appreciate. So my good people of Edo State and comrades here present, I want to appreciate each and every one of you. Uh, 
I'm indeed grateful. I'm indeed grateful for your time. Uh, so please, uh, I'll be leaving you all for now uh, because I have to attend to calls. I have to ensure that I call all the formations of police. Yes, well, I'm, I'm, I'm moving on live video. You guys should go there and share it because I've, I've tried to reach the Commissioner of Police, even the AIG. Uh, I'm, I'm on live video too, but uh, the next thing we need to do as a community, we need to protest. Uh, that's the next thing because we shouldn't just keep quiet. Now, this thing is getting out of hand. For them to have come to Clement's house to shoot him, I don't think uh, we need to fold our hands and keep quiet. We need to come out on the major roads and protest this abnormality. Uh, I'm, on, I'm on live video. I, I will call you the moment I drop. So it's it's very 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 wrong. It is very 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 wrong. I I for once uh, I, I keep telling you, uh, most of these communities that you see having problems, the police are the major cause. The police are the major cause. I keep saying it. Even when I went to meet superior authorities in Abuja, I told them that they are the major cause. But they will tell you that uh, they must investigate matter. Once they write petition, they must find out. They must investigate that if it is true or lie, the, the investigation will prove. But there's no way they will go and hold an innocent person. But as at now, I know Clement Gubadia is innocent. And I know that the young man is only somebody that believes that, yes, he has won from court and he must get what he wants. So I don't see anything wrong in that. There's nobody who will have a court judgment today over a property that will not go to get his property. So for me, I am, I am saying uh, as, as somebody who is informed, and I believe, I believe, I believe, I believe the Commissioner of Police is very, very professional in his, in his judgment. And you should also ask questions. You should also ask, ask questions because we were with him some few weeks ago as regards this same matter. This same matter. I'll be leaving uh, at, at the broadcast for now. But please and please and please, the police authority should come to the rescue of this matter because now you who have shot somebody, the impression it is creating is that the police is now aiding the Combo people to ensure that the silence the Goma people and continue to sell over their lands. Thank you and bye for now. Now we don't hear from Imalwe Aibogun, let us know what you think for comment section. If you never subscribe to Dan ARG YouTube, try make you subscribe so that make you for the hear all the things where they happen for Nigeria. Make I leave you with this video, make you help or share up. Thank you for watching Dan ARG YouTube.